Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of The Roundup. As always, I'm David Cantu, and today we have some movie news regarding Power Rangers and Justice League. So without further ado... I mean, it's so weird. The other night, I had a dream that Brian Cranston was cast as Zordon in the new Power Rangers movie. And then I realized it wasn't a dream at all, and I was all like... I'm not saying it's a bad thing. In fact, before I had said that casting bigger names gives the film a little bit more legitimacy. But I think I can speak for everyone when I said nobody saw that coming. I like the fact that he was cast. He has that voice that's seasoned and commanded. You're goddamn right. My only thought is that we may not see much of Cranston as Zordon. What I mean by that is that I'm going to go ahead and predict that he's going to be more of a voice rather than the floating head that we all remember. Filming is pretty much over if it's not already, so that's a clue that the character is going to be added in post-production or it's going to be a complete voiceover. It doesn't seem like it would be a big deal to him because he's no stranger to voiceover work or the Power Rangers franchise. In his early years of acting, he voiced the Monsters Twin Man in the episode of Bad Reflection on You and Snizzard in the episode Foul Play in the Sky from the first season of Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. The Power Rangers movie is shaping up to be pretty impressive, so as a longtime fan, I'll definitely be there opening night to see how it all turns out. The past few days have given us a lot of new news regarding the Justice League movie and the future of the DC Extended Universe. The most interesting tidbit, however, is that Justice League Part 1 and 2 are no longer Justice League Part 1 and 2. Instead, the first film will be a complete story from beginning to end, according to Zack Snyder. He was then asked if the film would end with a cliffhanger, and he very cautiously said, The movie doesn't end, and you're like, okay, well, that's the DC Universe. To me, it sounds like Warner Brothers is being very cautious after the reactions from Batman v Superman. If Justice League doesn't go over well, they could shift gears and be like, So yeah, you know that second Justice League movie? We're not gonna do that anymore. Instead, we're gonna do a Plastic Man movie. Just like when Batman v Superman was announced, I really hope that this movie's good. I mean, just for the sake of fans having more awesome comic book movies to watch. I'm gonna try my best to be optimistic and say that lessons were learned and things are gonna be different next time. We'll have to wait and see when Justice League hits theaters in November 2017. So how do you feel about Bryan Cranston being cast as Zordon in the new Power Rangers movie? Have you lost all hope for the DC Extended Universe? Let's discuss in the comments below. Click on Zordon to subscribe to this channel, give us a thumbs up while you're there, and if you can, share the video with your friends. Thanks for watching another episode of The Roundup. We'll catch you next time.